Sit down, David. Listen, you know I'm not gonna lie to you. It isn't a secret that the company's had eyes on you. Now, you and I are friends, so this isn't something I'd like to do, but due to your behavior, the company's gotta fire you. What? Wait a minute. There's gotta be a way I can stay. Not after you cooked all of that fish inside the microwave. You piled straight into James with your car, then tried to drive away. You tried escaping. Thankfully, cameras captured your license plate. Fine, okay, I get it, but can't you give me a second chance? You fell asleep in a meeting with all of the executives, and you're the one who's clogging the toilets. I didn't. Yes, you did. I'm sorry, but the company can't tolerate these messed up tricks. I know you've been pulling pranks and hoping we don't see it, but your pranks are freaking stupid. You do the stuff, then you tweet it. Plus, our company has files. You know we're supposed to be secret. And yet, our data just got breached, and I'm pretty sure that you leaked it. This is treason. It's like you took our trust and murdered it. Here's a thought. Practice humility. Ever heard of it? Of course you did. And maybe, just maybe, you'll go mature a bit. But as of now, our company no longer needs your services. All right, you win. I get it, buddy. You caught me. To be honest, it was wrong to be causing problems. I'm sorry. I guess somewhere deep inside, I had wanted someone to stop me. Now I really do regret when I peed inside of your coffee. You what? David, find your seat and take it. I see you get in trouble on a frequent basis. We all know you got a couple secrets, David, so tell me. What is there you need to say, kid? What do I need to say? Are you kidding? The school is a mess. The system is sloppy. The people are honestly awful, so let me confess. First of all, I'm not the guy with the problem. There's so many flaws that I find very often. Like fountains at school don't provide any water. That teacher just shoved the whole guy in a locker. I saw the lunch lady feed a kid dog food. Speaking of lunch, all the food here is awful. Janitor Todd only cleans what he wants to. Honestly, I've had no clue what you've gone through. Sure, but listen, it really gets worse. I'm not just spitting a verse. The system is wicked and twisted. The kids are not given attention while teachers are getting discouraged. I went to my class, but the teacher was asleep. We stayed after school because the bell didn't ring. My whole day was lame, so I went to the game and I fell on my face because the bleachers were cheap. Surely it's bad, but it can't all be like that. Sure, it can. You haven't seen what my eyes have. One time our bus had broke down, so we hiked back. I broke my leg and they gave me an ice pack. Look at these problems, you're proudly upholding them. I make all season, I'm valedictorian. I even cheat, but the teacher don't notice because he's sneaking off to make out with Miss Dorian. <laughs> Wait, my wife, Miss Dorian? Folks, in corner number one, we have the lean, mean muscle machine crusher. And in corner number two, we have David. Wait! No, there must be a mistake. You must be mistaken. I answered the act because I thought you were playing. I'm going to take all your bones and then break them. I'm going to mangle you. I'm going to strangle you. I'm going out of my way to put pain in you. Can't we just say enough? Why do we still have to fight? Because this is WrestleMania. Look, if you think I want to throw hands, I don't, man. I thought this was a hoax. I only signed up as a joke, fam. So please just let me go. Eh, no chance. Not until I've broken every bone. Oh, no, he's going for a joke slam. <laughs> God, I can't believe Jason just dumped me. Yo, he's a jerk. No, he's the worst. Oh, don't you worry, girls. Just trust me. Open Tinder. Oh, no, Linda. Let's just go back to our studies. Oh, just spend a little time on there. You might even get lucky. Yeah, what's up? My name is Chad. I go to school and my grades aren't bad. I play sports and I hang with friends. I don't know. He seems a little basic. Pass. Yo, my name is Derek. 45. Live with my parents. I got 19 different ferrets. I don't like this guy's appearance. Clear it. Evening, ladies. My name's Patrick. Work out daily. Yeah, I'm Madrid. I get paid. See, let's make magic. I think Pat might be a catfish. I want all your data. Next. I hunt things in danger. Next. Next. I'm a bit insane, but next. next. Hi, my name is David. Next. next. All these guys on here have no game. Uh oh, wait. I matched up with the guy who has a gold face. No, no way. I think it's a match. Oh, I cannot believe this. He likes you back and it isn't a secret. Tinder's like magic. Yo, Linda's a genius. Hey, baby girl, can you send me some beat pics? Ew. Ew. This is literally why I hate men. Oh, Uraka, I've come around to you too. You took your beauty and soothingness and compounded the two. I know you're still in mint condition, but you're about to get used. Son, I made you chicken nuggets. Mom, get out of my room. I'm a nice guy, but I'm so very unlucky. Man, I always finish last because the girls don't want to touch me. And I'll never take a bath. I don't care if I smell musty. I just go on Reddit forums trolling normies because it's funny. To all the Stacys and Chads, you know I despise you. And will you stop calling me short? You know I stand at least 5'2". I didn't sharpen my katana, so I can't even fight you. You need to stop picking on me for having anime waifus. Girls can see in me what I see in me and it's freaking mean. I walk into the party, they see me and scream, I need to leave immediately. The reason being I'm needy and creepy, geez, I was trying to keep the peace. Go back home and play D&D. That's an average evening for men who look like me. And I'm only celibate because we live in society. So I guess this is the end of story. Emotional inventory. Now I'm going home all alone to watch me some Rick and Morty. Please do at this. Okay. Story time. It was Thursday, on a first date, I was down bad, in the worst way, she was fine wine, I was thirsty, so I figured I might as well go and flirt, hey, it's so great to see you in person, oh really, because you seem a bit nervous, <laughs> well yeah, because I'm trying to impress you, what, I mean, I need to go to the restroom, so I go, but it's not gonna help, I just look into the mirror while I talk to myself, like, whoa man, slow down and compose yourself, if you choke, then you'll know that you're overwhelmed, yell you there, shoot, now let's make a break, better charm her if you're ever gonna save the date, okay, okay, I'll go and find a way to recover, that's when I see her Give the waiter her number. Dang.
OMG, Ramona's party was totally supposed to be like solo key, but Brandy came with Andy who wants smoke with me because Helen L was telling everyone I think that Ellen smells like LOL. She's such a gossip. I should really tell Noel that. Oh my gosh, will you just be quiet? All that I want is a moment of silence. How are you louder than a pistol without a silencer? I have heard sirens and fireworks manage to be quieter. I think it's funny how you're trying to be hurtful. You're like 5'2 rocking a Did face I like Urkel. Man? Great place for a date, huh? Yeah, the scenery's nice. Rude mannered ass dude with a side of fries. You see, when I came here tonight, I was kinda hoping to kiss you. Now you're here and you look nothing like your profile picture. You're a jerk. You're a nag. Hey, are you guys all set? Actually, I think we'll pay it with separate checks. Oh, hi, John. Oh my god, have you seen my dog? No, I've not. Well, I left the door open when I went to mow my lawn. And the little guy's gone? Yeah, and I don't know where, and I'm scared because I think he's lost. Well, now that you bring it up, I think I seen a dog run in the street by some speeding cars. Wait, wait. Are you kidding? Nah. Maybe my dog is just missing. Yeah. Maybe my dog's still alive on the street. Well, maybe then you should go get him. <gasps> you know what? You're right. I need to be fast. I really hope nobody hit him. Ah, uh, well, to be honest, they run in by car, so the doggy is probably not living. No! Wait, what? Take this tool. It may be too late to save him, and you may need to scrape him from the pavement. I really hate to say it, but it may be true. I hope that's not the case, but either way, I gotta go, so thank you, dude. Uh, one more thing I should say to you. What's that? <laughs> April Fools. Get it? Because the dog's fine. He's not hurt. He's not in the street. I, I was lying. He he's right here. Ooh. Ah, Detective Dave. Well, hello, Agent Jackson. What a lovely day we're having. Oh, goodness, David, what happened? Well, it appears to be a crime scene, one that just took place. Well, what do you think has happened? Hmm, let me explain. It was a slow day at the diner. A shift was aboard. That's when a robber and his partner came and kicked in the door. Listen, you stupid chick, you better empty the drawers. You see, she gave them what she had, but he insisted on more. You think this is a game? Nah, this ain't gonna pass. Quit handing me the change and go and hand me the cash. That's all that I have. Fine. Then get slapped in the face That's when the robber started popping off and trashing the place Emphatic with rage, he lashes out and smashes the place That's when his partner tried to stop him Man, get out of my way Hey bro, take it easy man, why are you so aggressive? She ain't giving us the cash and I'm not the person to mess with He goes to hit her again Then something gets to his friend The guilt and the shame from all the wickedness of his sins Lost worse thoughts of evil and being locked in a cell He pulls out his desert eagle and shot the robber himself Now he's looking at the waitress who's crying down on the floor He told her that he's sorry. sorry then ran up out of the door Wow, you got all that from just a Observing the place? Nah, the waitress lady gave me the security tapes. Oh. I know what you did last night. What? I know what you did. Girl, don't even trip. You know I was with the guy. Oh, sure. Hey, baby, what gives? I called your boy Frank and he said you weren't with him. Christ. Look, I can explain. I know it seems strange. See, but here you go switch inside. Stick to a story and get it right. Cause you've been lying. Really, it's not like that. You really trying to be pressing me. You really trying to be stressing me. Who is this girl you've been messaging? What? When I was alone, I went through your phone. I seen all your messages. I know you've been texting them. So who is this Jesse chick? Oh, um, I'm gonna call him. Wait, no, better start talking. Oh, if you would just let me collect all my thoughts. Fine, I guess I'll be off then. No, call them. Hey, baby, how's it going? I'm Santa Claus, know that I'm bringing the cheer Cause when I arrive, it's the best time of the year When you hear all the sleigh bells, you know that I'm near I'll be gifting you presents, then I disappear I'm putting gifts inside your stockings Then I take off like a rocket Rudolph flies to the sky like a comet You're gonna catch Christmas spirit, I promise Honest Yo, better back off You already know that I'm Jack Frost cold with the raps, y'all I chase the weather, I'm blowing your hats off Icy and clever, I'm freezing your ass off Colder than a glacier or frozen lake or a stone to stay I'm on my way to give you the winter frosty and snowy days I'll probably never change, so you can call me a villain But I ain't never gonna worry, cause you know I'll be chilling Who's that? knocking at your window is it santa claus no it's the grinch ho 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 sneak through your chimney i don't need approval snatch all the presents for christmas removal max and i run the show yes we are too real doing my dance while i terrorize whoville 